So today is Saturday and I am making my way to the Mall of Africa. I have a activation with L'Oreal and by the time you guys see this vlog, you would have seen that because I will be sharing on my Instagram as well. And um, yeah, I'm sorry that you guys are going to see similar content on different platforms but it is what it is <laughs> so i will be vlogging and taking taking you guys along with me even though you guys are gonna see it on instagram as well but i mean over here is going to be slightly different so i hope you guys understand but yeah that's what i'll be doing and i honestly hope that this was live so i could tell you guys to come through because um i need to invite you guys to come through to the mall as well since i'll be there for about an hour and um, yeah, I would have loved for you guys to come and experience the products and get your shade matched with some of my favorite products. You guys remember, I've once shared that this is currently my favorite foundation. I'm wearing it right now and I love, love, love it so much. So this is like one of the products that will be there on display. And yeah, I wish this was live so I could tell you guys to come with me like right now. But I did obviously like post something on my instagram and to tell you guys to come but i know that not all of you guys are on instagram so i hope that i will be i will be meeting a few of you guys today and i hope you guys will be coming through um but yeah i'm really excited i'm just there for an hour and this is my first ever like meet me activation with the brand so i'm really excited to see how it's going to turn out especially because today is a saturday but also because the long weekend i think a lot of people went home so yeah we'll just see how the day turns out but i am taking you guys along with me so yeah let's head to the mall and see how the day goes i'm really excited so we'll see each other at the mall Just for a while Cause baby I know it You know it We know it Deep inside We too addicted to friction To change our minds We so in love But babe it's not enough To survive Cause it's your way Love, love, love That makes us do All the stupid shit that we do All of the stupid shit that we do Just for a while Cause baby I know it, you know 
know it, we know it Deep inside We need help with these bad habits and foolish pride We're so in love, but babe, it's not enough to survive Cause it's your way, love My breakouts are finally gone, you guys. Look at that. I'm so happy. I am so happy. Honestly, I don't do anything special except change a few things. I think the biggest culprit for my skin breaking out in winter is that I normally take hot showers. Just throughout in general, I take hot showers. So in winter, it's recommended that you don't take um, hot showers because it strips your they strip your skin of moisture especially because the air is cold and it's dry so you don't need that right so now i know okay, that's my biggest thing like i take hot hot showers so i've been trying to um not do that and i've been drinking lots of water and yeah i've just been moisturizing my skin adding moisture adding moisture and uh, i'm much better now so yeah i'm gonna keep that up and then hopefully this will be me for the rest of the season but today is monday by the way let's sit down here let's sit down here for a bit let's sit down here for a bit so today is Monday and it is a public holiday. That's why I've seen my pajamas. So let's give it a check. It's a public holiday and on Saturday after my uh, mall activation, I quickly went into H&M to get a few things for this one for winter. Okay, so that's what I'm going to show you guys. So that's what I'm going to show you guys, right? So the first thing I want to show you is this. Um, it's a body warmer, this thing, man. I think they call it a body warmer. <laughs> I've got this. It's so cute. And I want to show it. them how I how I have it. Okay. So I got her that. And then I also got her... Mm, girl, it suits you. Oh, look at you. Hi, Bo. So stylish. Ah! So stylish. Yeah? I'm getting so tall. You're getting so tall because you're standing on the chair. You look stylish. What? Yo, I love it on you. And then I got her three of these corduroy flared pants. I love them so much. I absolutely love them. And these are jeggings. Oh, where should I put this? Um, you can put it there on the mat. These are jeggings and literally, literally three like this. And these three different colors. I love them so much. Like, I love them so much. These were $4.29 for all three of them. Then I got her this sweater. I got it this sweater guys can i tell you something man can i confess something ever since um ever since we've been a part of cotton on kids with ruine i haven't been buying her clothes cotton on spoiled me just because we were we are doing that man. i haven't been buying clothes for her because i thought ah, we've got clothes which we do but like i just feel like we're not expressing her style this the way i would like you know and yeah so that's why i went and i said you know what i'm gonna get her some clothes at h&m 
um and yeah that's what we did so i got her this as well it's like a very light knit perfect for autumn for layering as well it's very cute this was 179 and then for layering as well we got her this these are basic um basic like t-shirts they are long sleeve and it's a three there's a pink one she wore yesterday when we went to church and this was 229 i think that's the tag i think these were 229 for three ne? and then um we got this trick suit which i really love this trick suit these are the pants and this is the top and this was 239 by the way they have a three for two special going on so there are items that have this label when you buy when you take three of them you pay for only two so yeah i got a couple of that with that deal and then i got her these pants which i am so obsessed about i love them look at that flare i love these so much i love them so much that's what they look like and these were why is the label not here or oh, you're not early i think these were 249 i think this is the label 249 and this was the last size that sort of fits her but i'm gonna get it altered because it's long um but they didn't have other sizes like but i feel like i'm just like i'm not letting this go so i'm gonna get a tailored maudong and the waist is a little bit big so but we fell hanging right zipe and we are good and then i got her this knit where this was 329 how cute is this i love it but i actually want to go and exchange that i think that size i think size it on siaka speed so I'm gonna go check if they have um if they have a bigger size and then i got her this one as well i love this so much this cardigan it's so cute this was 329 it is super super stunning and then i also got her just a top um this was 99 rand this is also just for like wearing under a jacket or a jersey and layering up and then i got her oh this also in a yeah did you really need three these ones it's really three these leggings um yeah it's these these with butterflies and then these ones with little kitties and bunnies and these were guys i'm gonna press that thing with real can't find the price and then yeah these are also leggings and they flared at the bottom i love these so, so much as well these were 299 for a set of two the material is different this one is sort of like a ribbed material and this one is just plain legging material yeah, bring me the shoes, Rui. I have one to And then I got her this hat. It little scarf. Um, I get my price. I think. I think. Yeah. It's it. And lastly, okay, that's not last. Thank you. Thank you. And then I also got her some panties, which. I realized we're small so I might go change these as well for a bigger size we didn't open them so yeah I hope that they will they will be able to allow us to change these and lastly what I wanted to show you the star of <laughs> this little haul guys look how cute these shoes are these are so cute this is what I mean because this is how Ruby likes to dress like she likes to wear dresses you know cute dresses girly dresses and girly shoes so yesterday um she wore these as you can see they fail i got them on saturday and yesterday when we went to church she took these out she's like i'm wearing these i'm wearing a dress she took out the whole outfit that she wore for church so these are mickey mouse and they were 279 280 
and i love 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 them so much i'm obsessed with these and yeah that is the haul i am gonna yeah i think there's two items the panties and the knitwear a little orange and pink i think i'm gonna go exchange those and the yeah i think it's ju just those two i think i'm gonna go exchange those because i honestly feel like and i do not want that um but yeah that is the whole i'm gonna go shower now and eat i'm so hungry by the way guys my my favorite thing to do on mondays after cooking dumpling on a sunday is to leave some slices which i'm gonna have got here but or raw on my on my uh, steam bread oh honestly it's like the best especially because weather happy is so it's overcast and a bit cloudy so i'm gonna enjoy it i will catch up with you guys later i get to evening but yeah that is it for now eat and then maybe we'll go to the mall today little just to pass time maybe we'll just stay indoors and relax um, yeah, I love one.
by the way guys i realized that in order for my red cappuccino to keep its broth i need to add the actual content of this in cold milk so i previously used to warm my milk and then add the coffee in here but um, i've started adding this in cold milk and then warming it up afterwards so when i add this in cold milk it helps dissolve it completely so that there are no lumps whereas in warm warm milk it leaves lumps in my coffee and i don't like it so this method works best by the way we are having this for brunch today it is a sandwich from starbucks and it's currently my favorite It's macon and cheese on low GI bread and it is so yummy and by the way I'm the one that plugged my husband before he comes here to take all the credit for, <laughs> for this sandwich before he comes and takes all the credit for the sandwich I'm the one that plugged him so this is all me I'm so annoyed i'm coming down with flu and <laughs> it was so annoying <laughs> especially because the last time in Tsara, i think it was last year the last time in Tsara, i told myself that i'm going to be consistent with my vitamin c and zinc intake and i have not been and look where i'm at today and the thing is when it was during lockdown and covid times like i was very consistent because i was scared of obviously contracting covid and like i never ever ever missed a day but now since rinsa di maske and we've been free to do what we want i have not been consistent and now i'm suffering and i hate it so much and i think ginkilo ko ruwi but you know before ruwi would have it but now my immune system would be strong enough to like fight it off and i wouldn't get sick i hardly hardly ever actually i never got sick during that time when i was consistently taking my vitamins it's so annoying anyways let me show them to you guys um just give me a second give it at the gap so i started off taking just these dili one in 2020 ne? i started taking these dili one and they're for cold um cold and flu cold sores pimples acne and eczema they help with that as well so i started taking that and then take a lot started selling them together as like a combo 
and you would get this vitamin c as well so these are both from take a lot so this is your moment to take a screenshot these are really helpful guys these are really really helpful if you take them consistently i promise you you are hardly ever going to get sick from flu but nah i give my mail so here i am um yesterday Rui and i went to woolworths and i just needed to get more winter stuff or winter clothing for her and i actually thought after coming back yesterday with the bag that i should have done one video that just shows you guys her winter clothes like a winter haul for Rui's clothes i think i've done one of these two years ago and you guys enjoyed that but because i had already shot in this vlog i just figured oh, you know what let me just carry on but yeah i went to woolworths yesterday with her and got her more clothes and now we only need to get um like dresses winter dresses for church mainly most of the stuff i got are like trek suits for going out or for at home so yeah we just need to get um dresses for church and you guys i actually realized yesterday that i enjoy um winter or buy winter clothes i enjoy winter fashion for myself and mainly for ruby as well but yeah so i just found some cute clothes from woolworths so i bought these sweaters um so these are really no actually it was one one each that you buy and it's my daily two so it's this peach one and it's a fleece material and a gray one and they just say love over there and one was 129 and you guys the the one thing about bullets this morning i was showing my husband similar sweaters that i got for ruby two years ago or even three was it three no two years ago i think when she was still at crash i was showing my husband that the quality is still very good and they still fit her ish because Rui oh la slow like having the like a speed you know because obviously her parents are short so um she still wears them but obviously like i still it's a halenya i think did you love like mona did you so you know but she can still wear them at home so when i was buying these i'm like i need to buy these because i know i've bought these before and they still the quality is still very good and that's what i love about woolworths and then i just got her these leggings and these are the sort of um have a fleece inside it says brushed for warmth so this is what they look like inside very nice and warm and fluffy and this was 189 sorry guys hello um sorry about that and then i just also got her like a similar type but in a different color and design and yeah this is also 189 and then i got her this two-piece set it's this top just says happy as well as matching pants these come as a set and in really let's see in really 280 for these and then i just got her these pants i really loved these pants for 169 i really loved these pants they are just gray with flowers i loved them oh and then the one thing that makes me feel like such a parent i was even saying that to my husband this morning and we were laughing about it or the one thing that makes me such a parent is when i was at h&m the other day nay, i was shopping 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 for her and then i was like for pajamas and vests i know i need to go to woolworths for that you know when there's that one thing that you know i because of either the quality or the price or i don't know like um it's like a tradition in your family for me or for us it's pajamas panties as well as spencers or vests for those i know that woolworths has got us covered i those are just the things that i always get from woolworths so i get her these pajamas and these are really set like i always always buy her these pajamas even for summer but as a set 
so it's these ones they are fleece it's this and then the other ones give this pink with hearts on them yeah like that so they sell them like this as a set and they were let me see 449 450 for both of them and then i just got her these basic tees just for layering that one and this and i bought a um i bought a wanga 80 rand this color and these are the vests that i normally get for her these um two pack vests i got her a white one and gray and white one and then these are two pink ones i absolutely love these the quality of them is really really good and then i got her panties from woolworths these are panties i need to wash these panties from woolworths and then i got her i went to mr price and got her these cute adorable shoes how cute are these i can't wait for her to wear them for church with her stockings and a cute dress i love these so much and then i also got her these or we got um these crocs these are also so so pretty i really love the detailing on these very pretty so yeah that's everything so now the only thing that we need at least i know she's got basics like vests and winter pajamas and um you know she's got jackets so that's sorted and then just tops and track suits the only thing that we need now giddy like i said like a couple of dresses for church i try to go to Ackermans. i got a toilet that i like i checked at woolworths um woolworths has but they don't have like a lot of variety so they have these ones thinning like a top that you wear with the top underneath and then it's a corduroy dress but also i don't like the style because it's just like a straight cut dress and Rui is slim and she's getting taller now so she needs something that sort of has um what is this um how can i describe it like so and then it has a flare so something like that that sort of creates a silhouette on her body so that yeah she makes it makes her look nice otherwise she looks like long and straight and i don't know if you guys get it but anyways um yeah so that is everything i got i also wanted to say i'm so like so glad or so relieved that um and i've never shared this before so vulnerable moment <laughs> which is something that i hardly ever do oh my gosh actually yeah i don't i don't do vulnerability you guys it's something that i struggle with but anyways i wanted to say that um i'm actually so glad that or so relieved that Rui is catching up to her age so what i mean is that the clothes that i bought her now ne? and if you've met Rui in person like Rui is shorter than her peers ne? which i don't know why i'm stressing about this because it is the same even for me <laughs> like i'm not like short 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 but every time people meet me in person they're like oh my gosh you're actually so short like i didn't imagine you to be this short you know so i am short it's, it's an average height but i'm short you know what i mean so um so Rui obviously won't get the jeans dark. I'm not And I don't know why I always used to like stress a bit about her, like her height, especially when I see her amongst her peers. Like in her class, she's probably like the shortest. Um, and when I look at other five-year-olds, they're taller than her. You know, even outside of school, just at a playground or whatever, they're taller than her. And I used to stress a bit about it and feel like ish but i want to catch up and when people ask me how old is she and i'm like she's five and i'm like oh she's five oh she looks she's so tiny and i like i hate those comments and then i'd say like no but obviously yes she's tiny she's just like her mom you know because i also don't want her growing up i would want to say or people like people saying oh she's so tiny ing ing but anyways um what i was saying is that um <laughs> Also, yeah, I want to say a lot of things at once. Hope I'm sorry, guys. It's such a stressful thing. Like, the smallest things about your child will stress you, you know. So, imagine when you're 
I don't see it as being, you know, it's not the same, obviously. So I used to stress about that. So now what I was saying is that now at least she's caught up. So even when I buy her clothes in the past, I'd buy her a, um, king a year below. So if she's five, then I'll buy her four year old clothes. And uh, when she was three, I'd buy her two, you know? So, <laughs> Um, so yeah, now I'm buying her size five and I can actually see that she's getting taller. I mean, she's not tall, tall, but I can see that she is getting taller and it is such a relief to see her growing. So yeah, that's just a little vulnerable moment that I want to share with you guys. Uh, so you guys make a wish because this hardly ever happens and, um, it'll probably happen in the next like five years or so. <laughs> I'm just joking guys. But anyways. <coughs> I think we'll catch up later or girl sign because my girl specifically asked for me to pick her up from school today and today I just wanted to like take a nap because I'm not feeling great but you know she um I don't I don't pick her up from school her dad takes her and picks her up so when she asks for me I have to oblige give me light so I'll be picking her up from school today. So I think Gostani, I mean, I get to go to school, I think, or maybe in the afternoon, depending on how I'm feeling. I do want to take a nap, though. Get resting, yeah, at least, you know. Um, but, yeah. So, today is Wednesday, and I am making my way to an event in North Riding. So I'm going to a Bapanthan event in North Riding, and i'm running slightly late um but at least they made provision because they said it's it's half past 10 for 11 so it's currently half past 10 and i should be there just before 11 given that they start on time because these events they usually don't start kanako so i'm still on time the theme was pastel colors and i'm wearing a baby blue powder blue shirt with cream white jeans and white shoes and um yeah i didn't want to do too much so it's a very casual but also ladylike look so yeah i don't want to do too much um and then when i come back i was supposed to take Rui to the salon but we are taking her to the doctor instead because she woke up and she's still coughing so i decided we'll just go to the doctor this afternoon but yeah, come with me to the event and let's see what they have in store for us. There's no one like you, my little girl. Your eyes so blue on. She's known around the world. Uh, she's driven to just bridge that gap in terms of African involvement in the industry. Wonderful to have her with us today. Dr. Popo, I can't wait to hear what you have to say. Why don't you give her a big round of applause as our first expert. What's important to note is that in between the cells, we have lipids. That's, why we, that's what we need to try and preserve. To, to, to prevent the skin from getting dry and to prevent the cells from discommating. You can imagine that they are, as they, as they move from the basal layer to the top layer, they get thinner and thinner and become less attached to the surface. So when the oil is less or the lipid is less in the skin, we will lose the, the, the cohesion of the cells and they discommate and the skin looks rough and dry. We depend on the skin to show us. They will be hidden if the skin is not normal. TB, people think TB is only in the lungs. But through the skin, we can see TB, and if the skin is flaky, we miss it. We only see it when the skin is, 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 is restored. That, oh, I didn't notice that this patient has, 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 has this verrucous. I thought she was just dry skin, you know? So it's important that like that one, it just looks like dry skin. But it's actually tuberculosis. 
You know, when they say, if it's nice, do it twice, let's, let's watch it one more time so that I don't speak over the actual ad. There you go, Mr. DJ, why don't you play the ad once more? Dry skin, moisturizing only its surface is not enough. Deep inside your skin is where lasting changes can happen. The panthenderma's repair complex acts on the roots of dryness and deep layers of the epidermis for lasting hydration. New Bepanthenderma, hydrate your skin from deep within. New Bepanthenderma, it's an interesting, yeah, none of the applause, thank you, that would be great. Um, that phrase, new bepanthenderma, refers to the new range, because bepanthen, for those of you that know, is a product that was invented and launched in 1944, way before anyone here was born or was invented in Switzerland. Uh, in 2005, Bayer led bepanthen from then on to today, derma, the new range. Just tell us a bit about where that came from, what, you know, how was it built? Okay. Um, so as you mentioned, the panther. Hello, everybody. It's lovely oh. to be here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but you did say let's jump straight into it. You're right. I'm so sorry. She's right. Hi, everybody. So I'm Maseho, like Michael mentioned. Um, so as you mentioned, the panther is a global brand, right? Um, we're currently present in over 130 countries. And in those countries, we play in three um, strategic um, categories. So with all that said, um, when we do our brand planning on an annual basis, um, we do a lot of consumer insights. And one of those insights was that consumers are actually looking for products that they can use as a daily emollient, especially consumers that do suffer from dry skin. And that was basically the inspiration behind bringing this range of products um, from the world into South Africa. I'm not getting paid to say this. I swear on my life. I have been using the Panthoderma for about three weeks now. And a true story, um, and now I'm beginning to question with everything that's going on here, did Vipanthan reach out because they saw I had dry skin? <laughs> was it on my Instagram? As did I have an ashy ankle? <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I really, I, I wash dishes and I find so much joy. I have a dishwasher, but I find so much joy in standing at the sink, you know, and thinking. And so my hands have been very dry, especially between, um, you know, Washes. Yes, and um, I was actually going to see a dermatologist. Um, I wish you guys had uh, the images, but my hands were so dry they felt like sandpaper. And boom, the panther came my way. And I kid you not, within two uses of the product, the dryness had immediately gone away. And honestly, it's taking a little bit longer than usual to bounce back. I'm hoping yours bounced bounces back a lot quicker. If it doesn't, it's just a little test that says, hey, maybe I should concentrate on the hydration in my skin, on hydrating myself. Uh, Dr. Porter said, if you're an athlete, if you're running, if you, you know, based on individual needs, you might need to drink more or less or use better or you know, even better products. So that is a skin turga test. Before we wrap up, guys, and there is some wonderful food lined up for you, um, we thought we'd do a, a, a pledge um, a Bepanthen Hydrating Skin Pledge, which kind of just sums up everything we shared with you today. The pledge is going to come up on your screens. No need to stand, no need to put your hand on your heart or, or hold your skin to anything. So, just say this pledge with me as we kind of wrap up today. So here's the pledge. Um, next slide. I pledge. I pledge to honor my skin's hydration. To honor my skin's hydration by making it a priority in my daily routine. By making it a priority in my daily routine. I will drink plenty of water. I will drink plenty of water. Not eight glasses. Not <laughs> to hydrate my body. To hydrate my body. And use skincare products like the Panthenderma. And your skincare products like the Python Dema. Specifically formulated to nourish and hydrate my skin. Specifically formulated to nourish and hydrate my skin. I will pay attention. I will pay attention. To any signs of dehydration. To any signs of dehydration. Such as dryness. Such as dryness. Tightness. Tightness. Or flakiness. Or flakiness. And take immediate action to address them. And take immediate action to address them. That's, that's the first. I've never done that before, but that was kind of cool, guys. So thank you very, very much for honoring us in the pledge. Go on now. Be good. Be fine. Live your life. Dream big, don't forget to 
Be kind Live, it's your life Rocks are meant to be picked up and thrown New ideas can be pleasantly overgrown Play our part Go out now Be good Be fine Live your life Dream big, don't forget To be kind Live, it's your life Go on now Chase your dream Getting goodie back by excited. <laughs> I'm excited. One of the reasons we come to you is. I love you, Paula. Thank you. So, I just got back from the event and I wanted to tell you guys a few things that I learned, guys. First of all, it was such a beautiful event. Um, it was really beautiful. The venue was amazing and it was very informative as well. As you guys saw, we had speakers. But the things that stood out for me, guys, was that taking two showers a day is not recommended because it strips your skin of its moisture so it's only recommended that you take one shower a day and don't spend more than 10 minutes in the shower and this one which i spoke about a couple of days back is do not take boiling hot showers and i know a lot of ladies we were laughing the ibile at the event because a lot of women like taking hot hot showers and i'm one of them so we were laughing about that um, so that is not recommended as well as mixed um, like natural you know when people make like natural what is it man what is it called you know when people mix their own ingredients to create like a butter or whatever so apparently those things are not recommended um, and even though people would justify it by saying that it has it has natural ingredients it is still not recommended you know so i learned a lot about like skincare and taking care of your skin it was really amazing you guys would have um heard from the previous clips and speakers you know some bits and pieces of information i didn't want to bore you guys with like the whole stuff but yeah i think out of everything that was said this for me was um what i've just shared now was the highlight of today and yeah i just thought i should share it with you guys and it was the launch of the new bepan uh bepan is it bepanthen or bepanthen dema they were launching this new product and to be honest i can't wait to try it and this is the restoring body lotion i think for the mere reason that the product bepanthen as a brand like their products have healing properties as they say you know um if you're suffering from dry skin and eczema the products will really help with that sorry guys so, so yeah this is the restoring daily body lotion it's for dry and sensitive skin and this can be used on kids as well in small babies it's safe to use on them it does not have um fragrance if i'm not mistaken yeah i think it doesn't have fragrance and it is a repair complex product so it's very good for healing your skin yeah it says it has zero percent fragrance preservatives and colorant and it's suitable for adults and babies so i'm definitely going to use this for me and ruby because it is winter and obviously skin gets drier 
in this season. It's not winter, it's autumn. But you know, Halim Tamu to guys, how not autumn, but how to how to love at the fella give riha. It's winter, so I hope you guys get what I'm trying to say. And then they also gave us this gentle body cleanser, and apparently, this product is like very. Um, hydrating that even after using it you don't feel the dryness on your skin and you know you don't feel like you should immediately go in with a moisturizer so they actually have a lot of products um, but they gave us these to try and then this bottle um, you got this keep going almost done refill and repeat oh this is a water bottle for drinking water oh another interesting fact was that um, it has not been scientific scientifically proven that you need to drink eight glasses of water handlently. So just because in uh, uh, I mean just because uh, not glasses they eat them it or two liters. Just because uh, not glasses they eat them it does not mean that you are more hydrated than somebody else who drinks. I don't remember how much they said we must drink or is is the recommended liters, but eight glasses apparently is not it. And also apparently coffee is good for you. But yeah, guys, that was um, the event. It was really lovely. And these products will be available in the next two to three weeks, I think, at the scam. They're currently available on Take A Lot, um, according to what they said, and will soon be made available to like all retail stores. But if you want to try them, they are quite on the pricier side. To be honest, they did share the prices. I think this is about 400 and something um but be, because of the because of the what is it um the result you get out of using this if you have dry skin it is worth it will i buy it honestly yes if i wasn't gifted this um and in the near future if i do see that it works for my skin and it helps my skin i wouldn't mind buying it and trying it so yeah but anyways, guys, um, we've come to the end of the vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a huge thumbs up. Please comment down below and subscribe if you haven't subscribed to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next one next week. Bye, guys.